What's going on guys? Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Geek Fuel for this month. The new Geek Fuel EXP. We've got Volume 3. That's I guess how they denote their different ones now. So this is a big and heavy box so I wouldn't be surprised if we probably get like a book or something with how heavy this is but we'll have to just wait and see. So let's go ahead. Uh, first off we've got our thing that we'll look at at the very end that shows all of the items. Um, let's go ahead and look at this. It's a kind of a small thing but kind of fun at the same time. It is a sticker I assume for your car or something. But it says Excelsior, of course, a nice memory thing for Stanley. But it's got all the different like logo types. So of course, like the Avengers, X Men, Thor, Iron Man, Captain Marvel, Spider Man, Hulk, Captain America, and Thing there. And it has his birthday years for 1922 to 2018. It just says Infinity. Of course, of course, that fits. So it's a nice little sticker there for Stanley and stuff, and that's a fun thing. Next up here, we've got some geeky tiki's. It says mini tiki mug two pack, and it's Lord of the Rings. We've got a Frodo and uh, Smeagol or um, Gollum. Gollum, whatever you want to call it. So let's look at these. So here is the Frodo. So he is a green paint again. They designed it to look like you know carved wood and everything so it's got like a wood uh, grain design into it but they're just uh, ceramic cups and everything um, but I really enjoy these these things are kind of fun I mean I, we don't use them for anything we've got a couple of these before and then there is the golem one there of course with like a gray color and you can see it's ugly face carved into it there and then they have these like a uh, little like protrusions or whatever I don't know what you call them there and so you can stack them up too if you want to collect these you can collect them and stack them up you know like a um totem or something there so they're pretty cool and I like I've never seen Lord of the Rings one so this is the first time seeing those and I um, think they're pretty cool but don't really have much use for them next up we've got what looks to be a Doctor Strange I might assume this is our shirt because it looks like a lot of Doctor Strange going on here so let's see what it is um, so yes obviously Doctor Strange it is a licensed Marvel shirt so there we go we've got a Doctor Strange there doing oh, it's like a silhouette and of course looks like a universe or galaxy astral project projection. projection and then yeah he's doing some <clears throat> of his spells and everything going on it there and then on the very back it does also have one of them as well there at the top I feel the prints very small on the front yeah of the it shirt. does seem really small like it's really small for this shirt um, I feel it should have been bigger and blown up and stuff but um, I really I enjoy Doctor Strange so that's uh, pretty cool um, but I would like a better design maybe it just seems a little too plain and then like you said the small print next up we've got these he-man little things I don't know what they are they say Keshi surprise and they have a uh, Skeletor on the front so there's Skeletor he-man and beast man um, so we got two of them so I'm gonna let him over one and we'll open one so we'll see what it is they're already kind of open but they're little I guess little mystery figures um, so I'll have to see who we get. So here they are. So I got a Skeletor out of mine. So they're these like neon pink or hot pink uh, little figures and stuff. So again, I got Skeletor and bro got Beast Man there as well. Um, so they're nice uh, just little figures. Again, they're pretty plain. They're only one color and we got the neon pink ones. And then they also came with these little stickers, which I just dropped the Beast Man one. But a little ske sticker there with uh, Skeletor on that one. Then of course Beast Man for the other one there and they have that reflective background and stuff so it's pretty cool so it's just nice little figures it's cool that they threw two in so we could get multiple but of course there's three total um, and everything so that's pretty cool next up we've got a Marvel item I assume it's going to be another canvas print that we've been getting in the past couple boxes and by the look of it it's a Hulk because it's oh, it shows pictures of the Hulk right there on the front so, so there it is, Hulk number one comic right there. So we've got an Incredible Hulk, the strangest man of all time. And then, of course, we've got the Grey Hulk version there in the background and Bruce Banner there in the front. Again, a remake of the first uh, Incredible Hulk comic book. Again, we've been getting a lot of number ones, which is cool and everything. So that is a cool one to add to our canvases. Next up, so we did get a book in this box, and that's why I was really uh, weighing everything down. But it's called The Art of Mondo which I have absolutely no clue what it is. I'm gonna rip it open so I can see what it looks like. So yeah, I don't know exactly what this book is. Like I don't, I've never heard of like Mondo or anything. I don't know anything about it, but just looking through it, it's just got all these cool pictures. I don't know if they're like movie posters or what exactly, but they're just all sorts of these prints. Oops, got a page coming open there. But they're just all sorts of prints of cool different things. Like I saw Star Wars, there's a bunch of horror movies. Just all sort. There's Planet of the Apes and everything. There's just all sorts of movie stuff they do of the Universal Monsters. Um, there's just all sorts of cool like pictures and stuff. But I don't know what these are for or from or anything. Um, but it looks really cool. Like it's so. Um, I was just flipping through here, seeing a lot of cool stuff that I really enjoyed. 
Um, so I definitely want to take a look through this book like in more detail and see all the different pictures and everything. So there's a Star Wars one and stuff. Um, and so yeah, some of these pages do open more to reveal more stuff. So um, definitely an interesting book. I don't, I don't know what it is at all, but it's just a nice big art book and it's super big and heavy. So if you had like coffee table, this would be like the perfect coffee table book. So that's interesting. Next up, we did get a Steam code. I didn't, I thought they weren't doing these anymore, but we got Don't Open the Doors for a Steam game there. Again, we never play these or anything, but it's cool again that they throw these free games into the boxes and stuff, but it looks, yeah, it's just like a little... It's $11 value. Yeah, $11 value. It looks like you're in like a little Mushroom Kingdom or something. There's a bunch of mushrooms and stuff on the back. So again, that's a fun little game to add in. Next up, we got something that it looks cool, but in theory it's not. We've got Battle Tats Temporary Tattoo Pack from He-Man Masters of the Universe. There. Oh, sweet. So we got Battle all sorts Cat. of cool things. So yeah, we got Battle Cat, Skeletor, Orko. Um, looks like Skeletor's uh, top there. Triclops' head, maybe. Oh, yeah. Um, a crown, maybe, from the Queen. We got He-Man's sword and stuff. Um, oh, but, yeah. and then it says Eternia on the heart. Oh, yeah. I see that there. Um, so yeah, it's just a bunch of tattoos. Again, I thought they would be like stickers or just maybe a, when I first saw it, I thought it was a print or something, which would have been cool. But yeah, they're temporary tattoos, which is kind of disappointing because, you know, we don't have any temporary tattoos for anything. But it's really cool artwork, though. I really like that. And our last item from the box is our pins for the month. And again, they're doing these pin pals. And it is Firefly where we've got a Kaylee and a Jane pin right in there. So again, you can have the whole group with the Serenity being the rare one out of the set there and stuff. So again, you have, can get uh, the whole set there, but we got those two out of it, which is pretty cool. And I did want to show they've been doing this a lot with these boxes. They put a lot of artwork inside here. And so there we've got Castle Grey Skull there in the background of inside the box and stuff. So I assume you can take like your little He-Man figures and stuff and put them down in here so it looks like they're a Castle Grey Skull and everything. So that's cool artwork. So that is it for all the items. So now we can look at the spoiler book here thing for all of the items. So first up, it looks like we've got the Doctor Strange t-shirt there. So again, with that very small print on there. Wish it was bigger, but that's what we got. Then we've got the Lord of the Rings Tiki where the Frodo and Gollum pack. The Art of Mondo, again, that really cool art book that I want to look at all the stuff in it. Our Steam code for Don't Open the Doors. The uh, He-Man's of the Master of the Universe. We've got the tattoo, temporary tattoos. And then, of course, our little He-Man figure things there that, of course, can go with a box and everything. The, of course, the really cool that I really enjoy these, the canvas print of the comic books there with Hulk number one. We did get this thrown in because I don't see it anywhere on here. This Excelsior sticker, of course, for Stanley and everything. And then the last thing being our pin pals of the Firefly characters there and everything. So that looks like that is it for all of the items this month. Again, another cool um, month. Um, I feel the items weren't as great this month. Um, I really enjoy these. Of course, these canvas prints are always cool. And then I am really have a lot of interest in this art book and stuff. But everything else is just like seems like the normal stuff you get out of the boxes in the past and everything. But that's what you get, of course, with these mystery boxes. Not everything's always amazing. But I really do enjoy these new geek feels that they're doing stuff. And of course, they don't come every month, so we don't get as used to them and tired of them and everything. It keeps it fresh and everything. But that's it for this box. If you enjoyed, let us know in the comments down below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up. And of course, subscribe to the channel to see more. And we'll see you next time.